Welcome back to Bible Quiz. Today we will come to the topic. 25 Bible Quiz from Genesis to Revelation. Before entering the challenge with Bible Quizzes. Let's subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications so you don't miss the next videos. Let's start. Question 1. What did the chief priest and Pharisees give Judas to enable him to help arrest Jesus? A. A band of men and officers. B. A map. C. Swords and clubs. D. Silver coins. Time to think. Correct answer, A, a band of men and officers. Explaining the Bible, Judas then, having received a band of men and officers from the chief priests and Pharisees, cometh thither with lanterns and torches and weapons. John chapter 18 verse 3. Question 2. How old was Josiah when he became king of Judah? A, 8 years old. B, 12 years old. C, 16 years old. D, 20 years old. Time to think. Correct answer, A, 8 years old. Explaining the Bible, Josiah was 8 years old when he began to reign, and he reigned in Jerusalem 1 and 30 years. 2 Chronicles chapter 34 verse 1. Question 3. What was the name of Abigail's first husband? A. Nabal. B. Saul. C. David. D. Eli. Time to think. Correct answer, A. Nabal. Explaining the Bible, and there was a man in Maon, whose possessions were in Carmel, and the man was very great, and he had three thousand sheep, and a thousand goats, and he was shearing his sheep in Carmel. Now the name of the man was Nabal, and the name of his wife Abigail, and she was a woman of good understanding, and of a beautiful countenance, but the man was churlish and evil in his doings, and he was of the house of Caleb. 1 Samuel chapter 25 verses 2-3. Question 04. Why did Jephthah flee to the land of Tob? A. Because he was fleeing from Saul. B. Because his brothers drove him away. C. Because he sought a wife. D. Because he was pursuing his enemies. Time to think. Correct answer, B, because his brothers drove him away. Explaining the Bible, and Jephthah fled from his brethren, and dwelt in the land of Tob, and there were gathered vain men to Jephthah, and went out with him. Judges chapter 11 verse 3. Question 5. Where did the hypocrites love to pray? A, in the synagogues and in the corners of the streets. B, in the temple. C, on the mountains. D, near the river. Time to think. Correct answer, A, in the synagogues and in the corners of the streets. Explaining the Bible, and when thou prayest, thou shalt not be as the hypocrites are, for they love to pray standing in the synagogues and in the corners of the streets, that they may be seen of men. Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. Matthew chapter 6 verse 5. Question 06. Who did Paul heal at Lystra? A. A blind man. B. A lame man. C. A leper. A deaf man. Time to think. Correct answer, B, a lame man. Explaining the Bible, and there sat a certain man at Lystra, impotent in his feet, 
being a cripple from his mother's womb, who never had walked, the same heard Paul speak, who steadfastly beholding him, and perceiving that he had faith to be healed, said with a loud voice, Stand upright on thy feet. And he leapt and walked. Acts chapter 14 verses 8 to 10. Question 7. Which animal did the ten spies liken themselves to, when compared to the people of the land of Canaan? A. Grasshoppers. B. Sheep. C. Lions. D. Oxen. Time to think. Correct answer, A. Grasshoppers. Explaining the Bible, and there we saw the giants, the sons of Anak, which come of the giants, and we were in our own sight as grasshoppers, and so we were in their sight. Numbers chapter 13 verse 33. Question 8. After Pilate found no guilt in Christ, for what reason did the Jews say that Jesus should die? A. For blasphemy. B. For treason. C. For theft. D. For sedition. Time to think. Correct answer, A, for blasphemy. Explaining the Bible, the Jews answered him, We have a law, and by our law he ought to die, because he made himself the Son of God. John chapter 19 verse 7. Question 09. In a parable told by Jesus, two men went up to the temple to pray, a Pharisee and who else? A, a scribe. B, a tax collector. C, a fisherman. D, a shepherd. Time to think. Correct answer, B, a tax collector. Explaining the Bible, two men went up into the temple to pray, the one a Pharisee, and the other a publican. Luke chapter 18 verse 10. Question 10. Who were the first two disciples to be called? A. Peter and Andrew. B. James and John. C. Matthew and Thomas. D. Philip and Bartholomew. Time to think. Correct answer, A. Peter and Andrew. Explaining the Bible, and Jesus, walking by the Sea of Galilee, saw two brethren, Simon called Peter, and Andrew his brother, casting a net into the sea, for they were fishers. Matthew chapter 4 verse 18. Question 11. How many sons did Gideon have? A. 70. B. 50. C. 30. D. 100. Time to think. Correct answer, A, 70. Explaining the Bible, and Gideon had threescore and ten sons of his body begotten, for he had many wives. Judges chapter 8 verse 30. Question 12. On which day of the creation did God create trees and plants? A. Third day. B. First day. C. Fourth day. D. Second day. Time to think. Correct answer, A. Third day. In the Bible, and God said, Let the earth bring forth grass, the herb yielding seed, and the fruit tree yielding fruit after his kind, whose seed is in itself, upon the earth, and it was so. And the earth brought forth grass, and herb yielding seed after his kind, and the tree yielding fruit, whose seed was in itself, after his kind, and God saw that it was good. And the evening and the morning were the third day. Genesis chapter 1 verses 11 to 13. Question 13. 
On which island did Paul preach on his first missionary journey? A. Cyprus B. Crete C. Malta D. Sicily Time to think. Correct answer, A. Cyprus. Explaining the Bible, now there were in the church that was at Antioch certain prophets and teachers, as Barnabas, and Simeon that was called Niger, and Lucius of Cyrene, and Manion, which had been brought up with Herod the Tetrarch, and Saul. As they ministered to the Lord, and fasted, the Holy Ghost said, Separate me Barnabas and Saul for the work whereunto I have called them. And when they had fasted and prayed, and laid their hands on them, they sent them away. So they, being sent forth by the Holy Ghost, departed unto Seleucia, and from thence they sailed to Cyprus. Acts chapter 13 verses 1-4. Question 14. Why did the Pharisees deride Jesus when He said, You cannot serve God and mammon? A. Because they were covetous. B. Because they were poor. C. Because they were generous. D. Because they were tax collectors. Time to think. Correct answer, A, because they were covetous. Explaining the Bible, and the Pharisees also, who were covetous, heard all these things, and they derided him. Luke chapter 16 verse 14. Question 15. What was Samson's offer of reward if the Philistines could solve his riddle? A, clothings. B, gold coins. C, silver pieces. D, a feast. Time to think. Correct answer, A, 30 linen garments and 30 sets of clothes. Explaining the Bible, and he said unto them, Out of the eater came forth meat, and out of the strong came forth sweetness. And they could not in three days expound the riddle. And it came to pass on the seventh day, that they said unto Samson's wife, Entice thy husband, that he may declare unto us the riddle, lest we burn thee and thy father's house with fire, have ye called us to take that we have? Is it not so? And Samson said unto them, if ye had not ploughed with my heifer, ye had not found out my riddle. And he went down to Ashkelon, and slew thirty men of them, and took their spoil, and gave change of garments unto them which expounded the riddle. Judges chapter 14 verses 14 to 19. Quest 16. How many of Nineveh's inhabitants could not discern their left hand from their right hand? A. More than 120,000. B. 10,000. C. 50,000. D. Less than 5,000. Think. Correct answer, A. More than 120,000. Explaining the Bible, and should not I spare Nineveh, that great city, wherein are more than six score thousand persons that cannot discern between their right hand and their left hand, and also much cattle? Jonah chapter 4 verse 11. Question 17. What did the mighty angel throw into the sea that represented the throwing down of Babylon? A. A great millstone. B. A fiery rock. C. A crown of gold. D. A burning lamp. Time to think. Correct answer, A, a great millstone. Explaining the Bible, and a mighty angel took up a stone like a great millstone, and cast it into the sea, saying, Thus with violence shall that great city Babylon be thrown down, and shall be found no more at all. Revelation chapter 18 verse 21. Question 18. God calls us to a life of holiness, but according to Thessalonians what are we told we are doing if we ignore this advice? A, sinning against God. B. 
despising God. C. Mocking God. D. Forsaking God. Time to think. Correct answer, B, despising God. Explaining the Bible, he therefore that despiseth, despiseth not man, but God, who hath also given unto us his Holy Spirit. 1 Thessalonians chapter 4 verse 8. Question 19. How did Paul escape from Damascus? A, by horse. B, by disguising himself. C, in a basket through a window in the wall. D, through a secret tunnel. Time to think. Correct answer, C, in a basket through a window in the wall. Explaining the Bible, then the disciples took him by night, and led him down by the wall in a basket. Acts chapter 9 verse 25. Question 20. According to the book of Proverbs, what is bound in the heart of a child? A. Wisdom. B. Foolishness. C. Joy. D. Love. Time to think. Correct answer, B. Foolishness. Explaining the Bible, foolishness is bound in the heart of a child, but the rod of correction shall drive it far from him. Proverbs chapter 22 verse 15. Question 21. Which men murdered the Levites' concubine? A. Men of Gibeah. B. Men of Jerusalem. C. Philistines. D. Ammonites. Time to think. Correct answer, A, men of Gibeah. Explaining the Bible, the narrative in Judges 19 describes how the men of Gibeah abused the Levite's concubine, leading to her death. This act ignited a conflict between the tribe of Benjamin and the other Israelite tribes. Question 22. What happened when the third vial of wrath was poured on the earth? A, the sea turned to blood. B, rivers and springs of water became blood. C, a great earthquake occurred. D. The sun scorched people with fire. Time to think. Correct answer, B. Rivers and springs of water became blood. Reading the Bible, and the third angel poured out his vial upon the rivers and fountains of waters, and they became blood. Revelation chapter 16 verse 4. Question 23. On what type of stone were the twelve children of Israel to have their names engraved, as part of the high priest's garments? A. Onyx stones. B. Emerald stones. C. Jasper stones. D. Sardonic stones. Time to think. Correct answer, A, onyx stones. Explaining the Bible, and thou shalt take two onyx stones, and grave on them the names of the children of Israel, Exodus chapter 28 verse 9. Question 24. What sin did Achan commit? A, idolatry. B, theft. C, adultery. D, lying. Time to think. Correct answer, B, theft. Explaining the Bible, and Achan answered Joshua, and said, Indeed I have sinned against the Lord God of Israel, and thus and thus have I done, 
when I saw among the spoils a goodly Babylonish garment, and two hundred shekels of silver, and a wedge of gold of fifty shekels weight, then I coveted them, and took them, and, behold, they are hid in the earth in the midst of my tent, and the silver under it. Joshua chapter 7 verses 20-21 Question 25. Who was the father of Saul? A. Kish B. Abiel C. Nahash D. Jesse Time to think. Correct answer, A. Kish. Explaining the Bible, Now there was a man of Benjamin, whose name was Kish, the son of Abiel, the son of Zerah, the son of Becherath, the son of Aphiah, a Benjamite, a mighty man of power. And he had a son, whose name was Saul, a choice young man, and a goodly, and there was not among the children of Israel a goodlier person than he, from his shoulders and upward he was higher than any of the people. 1 Samuel chapter 9 verses 1-2